Um, this I, we're getting a lot of grounding and bonding stuff today, but this is an interesting one. So, Lee, uh, less is less is stuff. KK seven TPM says grounding rods in New Mexico. We've recently found out that everything was grounded to the waste water outlet pipe, not a ground rod. Now I know why I couldn't locate it to bond to. Ouch. So this is the same thing that happened to me. My house was built in 1969. This is common for 50s, 60s, even 70s era houses. So I had the same issue uh, at my old house. And so um, I talked to a professional electrician and what he told me is that now new houses, that wouldn't be up to code. You have to have a ground rod, right? But very common for the older houses that they're actually using those copper pipes to be grounded. I was talking to uh, my stepdad, actually, who he about this grounding thing. He worked on um, he was a contractor that put in water pipes uh, for like a, for like residential. And he said one time he was uh, upgrading these water pipes and he went in and he every time him and his guys were touching these water pipes, they were getting shocked. Oh, no, because I guess what had happened is that the, because everyone was using the water pipes as part of their electrical system, somebody had somehow connected a live wire into the ground of the electric and it was actually became live. So that's probably why they changed those electrical codes.